the, oh my gosh, this is dark. How come every time we do a podcast, it's always dark? Because you always want to go out at night. We're night owls. So, this is a little podcast for you guys. You know, if you flip it around, you can turn the flash on here. Yeah, but then we can't see us. I don't know if it's recording. I don't know. Well, you can do your phone. It's got the little white screen around the edge. It don't do that one. Well, anyway, we are doing a podcast real quick. Uh, can I ask you something? Why did we come over here? I wasn't even paying attention to you. This you is the way we're supposed to go. You're supposed. To, this is a longer way. You should have went through Proctorville and straight up past the school. Oh, well, this is the way we came back, so I didn't know. Do you know how? Do you know the, the way to get there from here? We just went straight. You sure? Pretty sure. Okay. Well, this just turned into a long trip. We're going out to eat. Forty-five minutes away, and you went the wrong way. Um, anyway. Okay, Miss Little Miss, I'm too busy to talk to the phone <laughs> instead of tell you where we're supposed to go. I don't live around here. He don't live here. You hear that? He don't live here. He's not been here a year. He just. I've been or here. Or been here. Look, I've been here a year. I spent 30 years in Houston. I knew every back road in Houston. I don't know every back road this little podunk place in in the butthole of America has. It's hard to find everything. There is not a freeway everywhere. Okay, well, anyway, this is fine. We'll make it. But, um... Yeah, you got plenty of time to talk to your little camera where they can't even see you. <laughs> We're doing a podcast. And this is our podcast. And I had a perfect topic. I wish I wrote it down. Now I can't remember it. Yeah. Um, World War III. Oh, yeah, we could talk about that. We could talk about that. Do you want to talk about that? Okay. So, apparently, there is a... It's going to be very controversial. It don't matter. Okay. It don't, it's a podcast. We give our opinions and we talk about it. Okay. Now, my podcasts are not on SoundCloud or anywhere else besides here, so we're very amateur. So, this is an amateur podcast. So, um, you don't even have to look at the screen because it's black anyway. You can turn... So, what's your opinion? I haven't... I'm telling them. Hold on. So, you do not even have to watch this video. You just have to listen to it. You're not missing out on anything if you turn to a different screen and just turn the audio on and listen to us, you can go do whatever you want to on your computer. Now, our topic of the day is, but wait first, before, we gotta do this right, we're a podcast. Hi, hello, I'm Miss Patricia Ann, and I have Mr. Glenn Austin with us here today. Welcome to the podcast. <laughs> <laughs> and today is January the 5th, 2020, and it's a Sunday. And the topic for today is... What is the topic, Glenn? World War Three, fact or myth? Um, I've seen a lot of comments on social media about people worried that we're going to have a World War Three. Can you? Yeah, we are not going to have a World War Three because look. It's... I hate to stop you right there, Mr. Glass. I'm going to need you to speak louder so the audience can hear you. We are not gonna have a World War Three, okay? <laughs> and why has a World War Three topic even came up? Because Trump took out with a surgical drone strike two of the biggest terrorist leaders in Iran. He killed them. Yeah, I didn't know that. And one was actually second command of the country. He just killed him? Yeah, he was their top general. Why did he kill him? Because they were planning on attacking U.S. Uh, US sites, and they've been responsible for hundreds of U.S. troops' death. Oh, wow. They attacked the U.S. Embassy. So he just made a it call. A, it was a drone. And just killed him? Killed him. Oh, my goodness. That's awful. Really? Half of Iran is cheering Trump's name, and the other half is trying to kill the people that are cheering Trump's name. I think Iran's going to have a civil war before they have a World War III. So, they plan on take, coming to America and fight them now, since their leaders are killed. <laughs> Good luck. What are they going to bring? A paddle boat? So... They'd have to get past the U.S. Navy. They'd have to get past the U.S. Air Force. We have defenses in place that will shoot missiles out of the air. I mean, come on. So, are you telling me that people that's scared that they're I mean you have friends that's even commenting and messaging you and saying that and he's 19 and he has a friend that's messaged him and said hey I'm gonna um, be drafted 
Yeah, I'm gonna be drafted. They, there hasn't been a draft since Vietnam. It's not gonna happen. So they don't draft no more. They, they, they haven't drafted since Vietnam. I've always heard that. I mean, you register for selective service, but that's a long shot. I've always heard that females don't really have much of a worry, which I don't know in this day and time. They may even draft females. Females don't register for selective service as far as I know. But times has changed. The minute I got my driver's license, or the minute I turned 18 and got my driver's license, I had to register for selective service. You had to? Had to. It was mandatory? Mandatory. Is it still? As far as I know. So you have to register? You have to. Or you can't vote. But what if you don't want to vote? You don't have to. Half people don't vote anyway. I don't vote. Look, when I was growing up, I was told it was mandatory. Also, this was 12 years ago. It's different time, way different time when I turned 18 than it is now. A bunch of pansies around now. <laughs> My generation, we had Desert Storm, the war in Afghanistan, the war in Iraq. I mean, come on. I remember when I was real little, the war in Iraq was going on. And that was scary. Why was it scary? <coughs> Nothing happened to you. The twin towers got blown up. Yeah, that was why we declared war. I know, and that was well. That and okay, everyone else could comment. Oh, we did it for oil. Okay, well, you know what? To each their own. It is what it is. We have plenty of oil in America, and Trump opened them taps. So I think Iran's a real danger because they're trying to get nuclear weapons, and you see, they want death to Americans. So they, so Iran. Are we allowed to post this on YouTube? I don't know why not. It's our, it's our it's current events. And it, you read the rules and stuff and it said we can post stuff. Yeah, there's no political views. This is political. I and mean, we're not showing videos of... We're just giving our opinion. Yeah, we're just giving our opinion. Okay. Yeah, I'm not really giving my opinion because I am asking questions. I want to know oh, what's going on. Yeah, because you're not giving your opinion because you don't know what's going exactly. on. Exactly. I want to know what's going on. So Most people don't know what's going on. They only know what they've read on their Facebook memes and all that. Exactly. So tell us what is going on so we know. Nothing's going on right now. Iraq or Iran is throwing out threats and have not followed through. They said they'll be attacking U.S. sites. A hundred Marines and a thousand more Army troops have been sent into the region. So you stay updated on I read the news. Now what is this all going on that they're talking about the Trump impeachment? The House of Representatives has voted to impeach Trump, so he's impeached. But it has to get through Senate before he's even removed from office. And it will not pass in the Senate because the Senate is majorly Republican. So so far, the House of Representatives, Miss Nancy Pelosi herself, is holding on to this impeachment to try and smear Trump's name with it because she knows it's not going to pass at all. And Trump's going to be our president for the rest of his term, impeachment or not. Do you think he'll get reelected? I'm voting for him. Okay. Now, our only president that I know of that's ever got. I think he stands a good chance because he's kept his word, he's done everything he said. There's more people working. You know, there's more jobs. He's t he takes care of our troops. I mean, the, 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 this terrorist leader, top general in Iran, is over there killing Americans, talking about more attacks. And what's he do? Goodbye. A lot of people are saying he abused his power. I don't think so. Obama ordered a drone strike to kill Osama. No one was grabbing that. As I said earlier, I have only known of one president to get impeached, and that was Bill Clinton. Is there one? Which one did he get impeached for? Watergate. Watergate. Can you explain? I am not about to give a history lesson. If you want to know what happened with Richard Nixon and Watergate, <laughs> go crack a history book. Okay. But you do know. Yeah, I know. Okay. Can you summarize it? So. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Um, do you enjoy talking like, I do opinion. enjoy talking politically. I do enjoy giving my opinions. And if anybody has an opinion and doesn't want to argue, they want to discuss opinions logically and decently, yeah, I'll discuss opinions all day. 
So you would be open to doing a live video and people coming in and talking to you and giving you typing in the chat and then you respond to them online. Yeah, I got no problem with that. Okay, so you guys heard that. It is pitch black now. This is a real podcast, Blackout. Um, comment below anything you want to talk about, anything you want Glenn to talk about, and we'll probably do live videos of him doing discussions with you guys on what you want to talk about. Or we can do other podcasts and have different podcast titles and different topics. So if you like these types of videos, give it a thumbs up, subscribe if you haven't done so, and make sure you turn all notifications on and check my channel because the notifications work sometimes, it works half the time, but check my channel out because there is uploads every day. I post every single day. So guys, make sure you just stay tuned and we will see you guys in our next podcast.